On this week's episode of Top Foods, we're in Jackson Hole, Wyoming. Let's see what it has to offer. On our first Top Foods, we're at Cowboy Coffee Company. Let's check it out. If this is your first time at the channel, welcome. We're so excited to have you guys. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any awesome videos we have coming. Let's eat some good food. Cowboy Coffee Company is everything that embodies Jackson Hole, Wyoming, and is what makes us love the city. Down to earth, very rustic, very cowboy feel. This place makes delicious pastries, muffins. They have all sorts of breakfast items, great coffee. It's the perfect little spot to start your day. We have been to Cowboy Coffee Company multiple times and had a good experience both times we went. Best items on the menu are definitely their made to order items like their Cowboy Burrito. My favorite is their Cowboy Croissant, but they were sold out of those. So we ended up getting a brioche instead, both delicious. If you're coming here, get the croissant. That's the best thing here. They were out of croissants, so we had to get the brioche bun. It says red pepper. It has an avocado aioli, bacon, cheese, and then a brioche bun. So I got the cowboy burrito. Uh, scrambled eggs, uh, pepper jack cheese, bacon. What's not to like in a burrito? And you gotta put hot sauce on it. It's just the way you do it. Get the stuff that's made to order because it's just fresher, better tasting. The stuff that's already pre-made is just, it's all right. But this place is still really good, so. If you're looking for a quick bite to go for breakfast, head on over to Pearl Street Bagels. Perfect spot to get some coffee, maybe some fresh fruit or a muffin, and of course, the fresh made bagels that they make daily. They had a lot of options on the menu. We ended up getting a bacon, egg, and cheese bagel on everything, as well as a bacon, avocado, cream cheese bagel that was delicious. What's going on, Journeyers? We are in downtown Jackson, and we are hungry for lunch. So we are here at Jackson Drug Co. It's the original soda shop. They got burgers, shakes, onion rings, fries, all that great, good American food. I don't know about you guys, but I'm starving, so I'll see you inside. the original soda fountain and I believe that's how it started was ice cream soda stuff like that but it's kind of grown into something more of that this milkshake this mint milkshake is absolutely banging Kelsey got the huckleberry one and Richie said it's really good too. too yeah so the, the food is any what as good as their homemade ice cream definitely worth coming to I didn't like mine at all. I actually really like Huckleberry, and this was an awesome milkshake. It's delicious. I don't want to finish the whole thing, otherwise I won't be able to eat my food. Make sure you come to Jackson Drug Co. Hungry. The portions are massive. If you want, you can easily share with somebody. The truck driver is a double bacon cheeseburger with two fried eggs. We got the black and blue, which is a blue cheese and bacon burger and Nathan got a homemade bison burger. All of them delicious. We got loaded fries, bacon, cheese, sour cream, chives. Literally, you cannot go wrong with this place. If you're looking for something a little more on the lighter side for lunch, don't worry, we've got you covered. Let's head to Persephone Bakery. All right, journeyers, you're hungry for lunch. You're near the Jackson Square. Uh, you gotta come to Persephone. This place is a James Beard Award semifinalist. Uh, great food, pastries. Uh, sandwiches, salads, breakfast, all sorts of good stuff, coffee. You will not be disappointed. Let's eat. It's really hard not to fall in love with this place the moment you walk in, the second you get hit with those delicious smells of the fresh baked goods, the pastries, the homemade baguettes, the sandwiches. You really can't go wrong with anything on the menu. They have a great outdoor seating if you wanna have lunch outside on the deck. And they also serve breakfast, which I hear is delicious as well. The great thing about this place, they focus on the small things, the details. Making everything fresh, doing their own chutneys, their own marmalades. I'm telling you right now, if you come to Jackson Hole, you gotta eat here. 
They're grilled cheese. It has um, arugula, tomato, like chutney, some good cheese, some apples, green apples. And then their homemade baguette, and then they hard press it. Yeah, this is a good sandwich. So mine has truffled prosciutto, arugula, some kind of sauce, I don't remember what it said, and then peppers. It's really like, it's super light, but it's delicious. It's got some good flavors. They are known for their pastries. They make all their breads, their pastries, like we got this, um, this citrus cake that I'm sure is gonna be delicious. The scone, they have two scones, like a black ch uh, cheddar scone and then a lemon scone. They have cookies, they have croissants, they have all sorts of stuff. Again, all made fresh. Citrus cake. It's light, airy, powdered sugar is good. Tastes like you're shoving an orange in your mouth. It's delicious. What I love about scones is that they're not overly sweet, but they're just right in their sweetness. It's yeah, like it's got a little, a little bit of sugar, but then it's enough of the savory where mm -hmm. it doesn't feel overpowering. There, that's a very good scone. <laughs> Overall, I would give this a grade A, but we want to show you guys probably our featured dinner place that we think you guys will really love. So let's go to Teton Tiger. Sadly, due to the height of the pandemic, we were not allowed to see as big a party as we had. So we opted to taking it to go and it was a really seamless process. We got a plethora of dishes, everything from butter chicken with homemade naan, to Asian chicken, lettuce wraps, pineapple fried rice, General's towels, chicken, pad thai, dumplings, and then delicious nomad egg rolls. Everything was made fresh and delicious and really gives you a feel for Asian food in the mountains. Teton Tiger's mantra is inspired cuisine from Asia cooked in the mountains of Wyoming. And I gotta be honest with you, they hit right on the mark. Happy. We wanted to leave you guys with a couple of honorable mentions. First up is Pinky G's Pizzeria. Diners, drive-ins, and dives. Guy Fieri himself actually ate here. Good pizza spot. Second spot is called Big Hole Barbecue. These guys make delicious ribs, and if you're looking for an authentic barbecue experience, it's the best in Jackson Hole. We wanna hear from you guys. Tell us what your favorite food is in all of Jackson Hole. If this is your first time, make sure to hit the subscribe button, give us a big like on the video, and who knows, maybe we'll come to your town for the next best foods. See you, Journeyers.